when you have a complex process like this one, which involves a mixture of manual machining and batch tasks, keeping a steady flow of work and short lead times is difficult. Hi, I'm Tim McLean. Welcome to this TXM Lean Minute. The key to streamlining production flow is to balance the process so that work flows through each step at a steady rate that meets your customer demand or tack time. The challenge is that machines are all designed to work at different rates and often with different batch sizes. Some machines are fast and some processes, especially manual processes, are slow. So how do you stop the fast processes rushing ahead and the slow processes falling behind? If you don't address imbalances in your processes, the result can be large backlogs, long lead times, and lots of expediting and frustration. Balancing processes first requires understanding the rate of customer demand or tack time. Even if your machine can run much faster than tack time, it's important that you only produce to meet the tack time in order to prevent overproduction. A value stream map can help you see the whole flow and work out your tack time and how to achieve balance. Visual controls, such as this simple FIFO area or planning boards, can enable you to monitor at a glance how your product is flowing and to act quickly when work builds up. By balancing the flow, you can usually reduce work in progress and lead time by more than 50%. This will reduce expediting, improve customer service, and actually increase productivity. So, Ask the team at TXM how to use a value stream map to understand your production flow and achieve balanced, level production through your factory. I'm Tim McLean. Thank you for watching this TXM Lean Minute.